HBAR rejected a key resistance level and if that sounds interesting to you, make sure to continue watching this video. We just hit over 100 Telegram members. Ladies and gentlemen, if you guys are not in this channel, you are missing out on some insane insight. Make sure hey to guys, check it out. Here. Welcome back to another HBAR analysis video. As always, if you do enjoy my content, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button. If you guys are interested in free $600 Bitcoin, make sure to check out the link in the bio. As you guys can see on HBAR yesterday, we were testing these beautiful exponential moving averages. And I mentioned the fact that if we were to break below this level and retest it as resistance, this could become extremely bearish. As of right now, though, you can see that we have successfully broken below the EMAs, retested them, and now we do have a clean confirmation to the downside. But I, of course, want to mention that we are still trading on weekend volume. You can see that this area right now is a very nice support level. We've seen multiple wick opportunities, but every time we break below this level, we get a strong bearish confirmation. This is exactly what I'm looking for right now to actually go and retest our major support level here at 0 0.057. Use that level as a a second and third test opportunity and then a strong continuation to the upside right now our main target of focus will remain around 0 0.08 as you guys already know looking at previous price analysis if we were to break above the 0 0.08 level this could be an extremely explosive move once we break above that level of course the next level is going to remain around 0 0.097 but once again if we pay attention to the resistance levels here after 0 0.097 there really isn't much resistance to 0 0.15 this could easily be a massive opportunity on hbar continuing to push higher because once again for those of you that have been doubting this massive move to the downside you can you can understand the fact that hbar was one of those coins that were extremely oversold we had a massive downtrend opportunity and you can see that within a few days hbar did drop from around 53 cents all the way down to around 21 which is of course a massive fluctuation in price this is exactly why i mentioned to you guys that the 0 0.035 level is going to be playing as a very important part in this major move and you can see that we did get only one retest opportunity but look at the candle that closed this is a hammer candle followed by a bullish engulfing candle this was a strong continuation move and this was a very easy trade opportunity hammer candles usually align at the bottom of a move and tell you that the trend is going to change this paired with the fact that we were on a daily support level as well as the fact that rsi was in extreme conditions for those of you that were in the telegram channel i have taught you guys this many times to look out for these sort of formations with this continuation right now we do have a beautiful continuation to the upside. You can see that we had an absolute parabolic move, but now I think it is time for us to finally come and get a proper pullback opportunity. Now, of course, if we do trade on Monday morning and we actually do see manipulation over the weekend and a strong continuation, I'm going to be paying attention to around 0 0.073 for this area of support. Now, looking at the hourly time frame, you can see that we are looking pretty bearish here. We have a clean confirmation to the downside. We've been pretty much ranging over the weekend in this neutral zone so be very careful as you guys are trading the markets are extremely choppy and ideally you don't want to try to get caught in between these positions but if we do have a strong break to the downside our area of take profit will remain at 0 0.057 now speaking about the daily time frames this is pretty interesting you can see that we have yet to go and test our 20 exponential moving average from yesterday's video i also mentioned this is going to be playing a very important role but you can see that as of right now we do have a pretty good pullback opportunity i wouldn't be surprised if we did get one last squeeze to the upside grab that liquidity and then a stronger continuation because as of right now you can see that h bar is still one of those coins that is still in the overbought region as well as the fact that we had multiple green candlesticks in a row i still would like to see a little bit of a stronger pullback somewhere around this range and then a continuation but of course if we do expect that wick opportunity now i would not be surprised but that's pretty much all i have for you guys today as always if you do enjoy my content make sure to hit that like and subscribe button if you guys are interested in free 600 bitcoin make sure to check out the link in the bio and i hope you guys have a